so it's a bit weird. I know it's a bit weird this video open up all night. Um I have one of my friends is in the hospital and you know I'm very concerned my sister's written and I have to say it's heartbreaking. It's really devastating that you know you can't go in to see them, you can't go in and see them okay. Because usually when some of my friends were in hospital for small different things you know, you went in, you could talk to them for a few minutes first, and I was sending you bring in some stuff for them. Um, and you know, that was that was good, and you know, you know, it's hard now, it's really, really hard now. Um, I just got this nearly two hours ago at one o'clock, three o'clock now in the morning. I hardly doubt I would get any sleep tonight. Um, we're worrying about it. I'm not gonna lie to people. Um, really, just been sitting around, you know, waiting for something to come through. About the full details. Um, but yeah, it's extremely tough. It's extremely tough. It's extremely tough on people. And then I, I was given other news about what well, the last time I made the video around 11 o'clock um, of something else. And you know, it was obviously f extremely disturbing and something that should be looked into. Um, and that's to, do, that's to do with something. Um, but that's a different topic altogether. But it's something very disturbing. It's something else that's bothering me at the moment. Um, and obviously will be locked into it, but I don't have the strength now to go and look into it. Um, but yeah, it's very concerned and very worried. Um, I have to say, very worried, very concerned. Um, you know, it's, you know, it's got to be tough. It really, really has got to be tough. For people in hospital now, we can't see anybody, can't have any visitors. It's got to be tough. It really, really is. Um, you know, it's just, I don't know. I really don't know. I honestly don't know. I just don't know. I really, like, I don't know where the world's coming to. I don't know what's, I don't know. I really, really don't know what the world's coming to. I don't know what this country's coming to. I don't know. I really don't know. I just, I am... You know, I often wonder to myself, what's, what's the meaning of life? I often wonder, I often think that to myself. But the meaning, you know, the thing is, and this is the thing lockdowns really taught me something, that life is so precious. We don't know where we could be tomorrow. We don't, I don't know if I could be here in 10 minutes. I don't know if I could be here in 5 minutes. Something could happen, you know, the house could go on fire, you know, could fall down a hole here. You know, you just don't know. This is the thing. You know, I never... You never can predict the future. And that's something that's scary. It's scary to take. And it's scary to... To be so... Because again, I'm trying to describe how I feel at the moment. I feel so helpless. That I can't do anything for my cat going to see him. I feel helpless. I might as well say straight. Um, I'm just helpless. I'm just utterly helpless. I feel utterly helpless here, and but I can't do anything. I just feel useless. And that's something that you know I'm trying to, trying to walk out here. I suppose in my head because you know, I feel very, like I'm abandoned. I'm a mouse of taste, right? But I can't do anything. I'm a mouse of taste, right? There's nothing I can do because there's strict policy in the hospitals and those homes that you can't full stop. Especially now you can't go in full stop, full blank unless the person's, on the forge of that. You can't go in. And you know, it's tough. It's tough. It's tough on people. It's tough. I know there's a lot more people probably serious than him. But again, it's just, a, it's, it's, I don't know. I just, I, I, I could randomly just said to talk about it. Because, you know, I just, I just don't know. I honestly don't know. I really, I'm gobsmacked. You know, I'm, I just don't know. I just, like, I don't know what to say. It's half, it's nearly half three in the morning and, I don't know, I really don't know, and then the other thing I have to deal with too is, you know, something that has to be locked into, but sure. Hopefully get the time tomorrow sometime anyway. But, um, please God that, you know, we get through, we, 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 hopefully, please God, I don't know exactly what's the cause, but it seems pretty, very serious enough for him to be admitted into the hospital this time. Um, but hopefully he's, he's okay, because again, it's very hard to get hold of anybody. Um, in his family, which is obviously understandable, you know, they probably need the time just to meet probably a space for a moment. 
Um, because again, I don't know. We really don't know what happened to him. Um, but yeah, but I just say to people, you know, to mind each other. And that's what you all have to say, because, you know, it's, it's hard. You know, it's difficult. And this person on top of it, I would have taken, and I might have said, I would have thought he's a strong fellow. Um, but apparently my predictions are wrong. And apparently I was at wrong that, it, that, you know, because all of us can get sick, no matter how strong we are. And, you know, we're all human beings, you know, and we can always, you know, there's nothing that can, I just, I just I'm probably wanting, I just don't know, my mind's just as well, I just really don't know, and um, forgive me for this, because I just wanted to talk, um, this is just, uh, I don't know, it's again, I just, at the same time, it's just kind of a good, kind of explanation, to what people are feeling when they can't go in to visit loved ones in hospitals and that's you know, that's what you're feeling at the moment, that's what I'm feeling, I'm feeling utterly helpless here and I just don't know, I really just don't know I'm just sitting here and I don't know about the other thing too, I just just, it's kind of incomprehensible just, I don't know like it's two things like it came in a very short time and it's shocked me to the core and why is it that straight? So please mind yourselves and look after yourselves. And if you're watching now at 3 o'clock in the morning, I hope you have a good night's sleep and take care of yourself. Goodbye.